In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. St. Faustina's Prayer for Sinners. O Jesus, Jesus, eternal truth, our life, I call upon you, and I beg your mercy for poor sinners. O sweetest heart, my Lord, full of pity and unfathomable mercy, I plead with you for poor sinners. O most sacred heart, fount of mercy, from which gush forth rays of inconceivable graces upon the entire human race, I beg of you my life for poor sinners. O Jesus, be mindful of your own bitter passion, and do not permit the loss of souls redeemed at so dear a price of your most precious blood. O Jesus, when I consider the great price of your blood, I rejoice at its immensity, for one drop alone would have been enough for the salvation of all sinners. Although sin is in the midst of wickedness and ingratitude, the price paid for us can never be equaled. Therefore, let every soul trust in the compassion of the Lord and place its hope in your mercy. You God will not deny this mercy to anyone. Heaven and earth may change, but God's mercy will never be exhausted. Oh, what immense joy burns in my heart when I contemplate your incomprehensible goodness, O Jesus. I desire to bring all sinners to your feet, that they may glorify your mercy throughout endless ages. Amen. The Divine Mercy Novena, Fifth Day. Today bring to me the souls of those who have separated themselves from my church and immerse them in the ocean of my mercy. During my bitter passion, they tore up my body and heart that is my church. As they return to unity with the church, my wounds heal, and in this way, they alleviate my passion. Most merciful Jesus, goodness itself, you do not refuse light to those who seek it of you. Receive into the abode of your most compassionate heart the souls of those who have separated themselves from your church. Draw them by your light into the unity of the church, and do not let them escape from the abode of your most compassionate heart. But bring to God that they too do come to glorify the generosity of your mercy. Eternal Father, turn your merciful gaze upon the souls of those who have separated themselves from your Son's Church, who have squandered your blessings and misused your graces by obstinately persisting in their errors. Do not look upon their errors, but upon the love of your own Son, and upon his bitter passion, which he underwent for their sake, since they too are enclosed in his most compassionate heart. Bring it about that they also may glorify your great mercy for endless ages. Amen. You expire, Jesus, but the source of life gushed forth for souls, and the ocean of mercy opened up for the whole world. O fount of life, unfathomable divine mercy, envelop the whole world, and empty yourself out upon us. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus, as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus, as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus, as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I believe in God, the Father, Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord 
who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, 
have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In the atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, For divine mercy. O oh, greatly merciful God, infinite goodness, today all mankind calls out from the abyss of its misery to your mercy, to your compassion, O oh God. And it is with its mighty voice of misery that it cries out, Gracious God, do not reject the prayer of this earth's exiles. O oh Lord, goodness beyond our understanding who are acquainted with our misery through and through, and know that by our own power we cannot ascend to you. We implore you, anticipate us with your grace, and keep on increasing your mercy in us, that we may faithfully do your holy will all through our life and at death's hour. Let the omnipotence of your mercy shield us from the darts of our salvation's enemies, that we may with confidence, as your children, await your Son's final coming, that day known to you alone. And we expect to obtain everything promised us by Jesus, in spite of all our wretchedness. For Jesus is our hope. Through his merciful heart, as through an open gate, we pass through into heaven. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Amen.
Hi, I'm Father Chris Alar of the Marian Fathers, inviting you to join us for a weekly walk through one of the greatest gifts of our faith, Divine Mercy. Our brand new show on EWTN called Living Divine Mercy explores the many amazing graces God gives us with teaching and personal stories of people just like you who are living divine mercy every day. So get ready for a spiritual adventure with Living Divine Mercy beginning Wednesday, September the 8th at 6.30 Eastern Time on EWTN.